what is up guys this is my uh, second attempt trying to make this video and um i just wanted to come on here and talk about some things that have been going on with me um because i really don't have anyone else to talk to right now um my uh just found out that my friend my close friends passed away last night in a accident um, um, very unfortunate situation um, I'm trying to wrap my head around you know that she's not here anymore um, I kind of blame myself because you know I, I kind of let a significant other at the time uh, get in the way of me and hers friendship and um, I uh, you know she for a while there she she even kind of cut me back and didn't want to talk to me because I allowed us to kind of fall out and we kind of lost connection there for a little bit um, but you know it had it, been a, maybe a week or two since I last talked to her and we were trying to slowly build things back up, or at least I was, um, and I was, you know, trying my best to be there for her, for anyone that, you know, be her, be there to talk to her about things that have been going on and everything, and um, we hadn't had, like, an in-depth conversation in a while, but um, we, uh, we were, I feel like we were getting somewhere. Um, it just lets you know, guys, that, uh, you know, the, you, you don't, you don't want to let a temporary situation cloud your judgment because, like I said, I feel guilty to a point because I could have had a and I'm talking about maybe two years ago, you know, I would have had another two years with this person, you know, two years of making memories and, 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 and experiences and everything with this person. And because I let someone get in the way of something that I had, um, now I'm sitting here wishing and regretting that I hadn't and that I should have just stuck to my guns and kept her in my life um, don't let a temporary situation cloud your judgment for the future because you don't know when anyone's time is you don't know when anyone's time is you don't know when your time is anything can happen and you know I think this is a sign from God because you know me and my dad, we've been having some issues recently, and uh, he, you know, was telling me about my aunt, and uh, she's uh, suffering from dementia, and she's been in and out of the hospital recently, and even though we were having, you know, we were arguing and, and fighting, he called me and told me that, you know, just to be cognizant and aware that, you know, her health is not doing, her health is not the best right now, and you know, if something were to happen, try not to be surprised or, or taken off guard. And, you know, he was talking about, you know, I need to be more aware. I need to be more aware um, because we don't know when anyone's time is. We don't know where my time is. We don't know when your time is. And I think I was kind of taking it for granted because I was just like, you know, surely nothing's gonna happen, you know, and surely she'll make the make it through this. And I know it wasn't her that passed away, but what really gets me is she woke up that morning, yesterday morning, because it happened last night. She woke up last night, or woke up yesterday morning, and she just got this new motorcycle, um, and I. I had told her she needed to be careful with it and everything. And it wasn't new. I think it was used or something. Besides the point, 
Um, she got up and she probably thought, you know, what am I gonna do with my weekend? How am I gonna spend my weekend? And then was probably thinking about her job on Monday. She might have had work uh, yesterday. I don't know, but she posted a listing on Facebook about how she was trying to sell the bike. Um, and um, I just think it's very eerie and just so tragic that not even after, not even a full maybe hour after she had posted that, or I don't know, I don't know, I'm not exactly full of the timestamps or anything, but before that she had put that on Facebook and she passed away it's not too long after and it's just really tragic so um I'm gonna take I mean I'm already I already put some uh, uh I already put some um I already got some plans uh I'm on my way to the beach right now and I didn't want to kind of bail on the the people that have made plans with me and everything so um, I really wish I wasn't having the drive but I'll feel bad if I don't um, follow through with these plans and um, so uh, um, I'll post some videos here soon I mean I was working on a video from one of my other channels last night and I, I don't know, I just couldn't, I couldn't finish. And this is before I even knew what had happened. I just, I don't know if it was some type of intuition or like some gut feeling or something, but something was off. I couldn't, I just had a, a, a lot of anxiety. Um, I couldn't really even function. Like uh, I could function, but I just couldn't, every time I try to edit or try to finish the video, I couldn't. And um, I think it was just, like I said, my inner intuition or my, my gut feeling or some, some, something let me know that something was wrong. Um, but yeah, I don't even know why I'm making this, but, uh, you know, I didn't, like I said, I don't really have anyone else to talk to about this stuff. So don't let, again, don't let a temporary decision or temporary situation take away from you know what you have going on um with somebody you know call them call every check in with everybody you know make sure they're okay and um you know you never know when it's your time so uh if you did watch to the very end i appreciate you i appreciate everyone that has stayed on this channel and have supported me in any way shape or form i really appreciate it um I will, obviously I'm gonna take a few days um, to try and compress and, you know, really suck all this in and, or take all this in. And, um, so, all right, so I'll catch you guys later. Peace.